Hello. So I haven't filmed a vlog in a while. Not since the, the bodybuilding days. Um, basically, I want to do one about the, the new gym. So if you follow me on Instagram and Facebook, etc., you'll know that I've, I've opened my own place. So the gym is the Daniel Lee Fitness Barbell Club and we focus on powerlifting and Olympic weightlifting. So yeah, I just thought I'd give you a little video to introduce you to the place and then show you around a little bit. But um, yeah, so we focus mainly on those two disciplines and it's mainly gonna be focused on group coaching, private coaching, that kind of thing. We will have open memberships for coach clients. We don't really want just random people coming in. We wanna make sure that the people that do come in are lift lifting and training to a certain standard. Um, so that's no offense to anyone who doesn't want coaching. It's just, that's just the rules. Um, so yeah, that's my gym, the other ones. So yeah, on that note, I will give you a little tour. So if you come with me, here we have the door. It's quite obvious. So from here, we have a squat rack over here, which is sort of, that's mainly like a spillover kind of thing. You'll see in a sec that we have combo racks in the corner. So over here, we have Olympic weightlifting. There's a couple of platforms, two, set, two full sets of plates some change plates we have two women's bars and three men's bars some broomsticks spare set of squat stands then we have some more steel plates over here and again faster bench which is similar to a comp bench which is quite nice another rack with a safety squat bar and plenty of bands on the floor i will get some um hooks or something like that for them there's another platform and some more bars foam roller a chalk stand made by Hodgie, as well as the platforms. Hodgie made all the platforms, and everyone is a big fan of them, and Hodgie in general. Loads of plates. I didn't quite mean to, but I managed to get all the plates to look the same. So we have the strength shop, um, zinc plates there, and the mid fit chrome plates over there. So yeah, two deadlift platforms, deadlift bar. And then we have two combo racks. And then, as I said, more plates. There's also an AOA squat bar, a strength shop deadlift bar, an Ivanko power bar, which Coach Grace has generously let us use. Uh, a couple of other power bars as well. There's one on the first rack over there, and one over here. So we've got a mini fit bar and an extreme fitness tiger bar. Um, as you can see, we still have quite a few mats that we need to to basically just finish using. So at some point we're gonna just come in and cut them and get them to fit into places like that, that you can see there. So while we are quite functional, there's still a fair bit of work left to do. Um, I mean, it's mainly, it's mainly cosmetic stuff to be honest. But yeah, just to continue with the tour, down here, please ignore the bin bag. I will get a bin at some point. We have a changing room slash kitchen. So there's space for people to put the stuff, as long as it doesn't get too messy. We're going to get a bigger shelf to fill that space. Uh, we have the obvious essentials, kettle, microwave, fridge. Now, this one's going to be a little bit behind the scenes because this room is an absolute tip. It's meant to be my office, but I'm going to take the light on. As you can see, all the boxes from the plates, the bars, the combo racks, the paint, Everything is in here right now. This will get cleared and it, <clears throat> and it will become an office of some sort at some point. Doo -doo -doo. And over here we have the toilet, which you know is always useful. So yeah, there's your little tour. Um, what else do we have? I think I've gone over most things. We have some kettlebells, some Olympic dumbbells that you throw plates on. Uh, some more set dumbbells. Um, we have a speaker. We have a really big deadlift jack. Don't really know why it needs to be that big. I'll probably get another one at some point. Well, it's a little bit more normal sized. Uh, we have a cable system as well, which you can see here. And that just clips up to up here. So we can do more bodybuilding stuff with that and the dumbbells. 
And then, just to show you, one of the main things about this place is that we have a lot of parking. So it's a little bit busy right now. I say a little bit. So you can see all the spaces here. We also have a really good bakery just there, the wild loaf. A hair salon, a beauty salon, sorry. And then over there is a Costa subway and a chicken place. And then a go kart place over there. So, oh, just to uh, get me back on the screen. Get that straighter. We also, just a few minutes down the road, so maybe maybe a four or five minute walk that way, is Brunswick train station. So if you're driving, you've got all that lovely space outside to park in, um, which generally doesn't get busy unless it's a Saturday morning, and that's when the, the wild loaf, the bakery, gets really busy. So other than Saturdays, you'll have space to park. Even on Saturdays, you can park along the road outside as well, because it, none of it is paying display. The train station, as I said, is about a four minute walk, which is also about a three minute train ride from Central. Pardon me. For me, I get the train from Moorfields and it takes seven minutes in all. So it's, it's quite easy to get to. It's a little bit outside of town. A um, little bit of a pain to get a bus to, but trains and driving, dead easy. Um, so yeah, I just thought I'd do a little intro. And this is this is the gym. So if you wanna if you wanna come down and try it, let me know. Um I don't really plan on doing like open memberships other than people who are coached, as I said earlier. But I don't mind doing the occasional drop in session for people. Um as long as it doesn't clash with anything. So feel free to get in touch if you wanna give it a try. Uh we have some events coming up. For example, we have the club competition in mid April, which is the sixteenth of April. There's still space for that, so if you want to enter that, you're welcome to. We also are hosting a Northwest University Championships at the end of the year, which is a full sanctioned IPF competition. You qualify for books, you qualify for juniors from that. You just need to be a Northwest Powerlifting member, sorry, a British Powerlifting member in the Northwest and be a student, basically. Um, so, yeah. If you have any questions, feel free to get in touch. If you want to come down, again, feel free to get in touch. If you want to join, definitely feel free to get in touch. Uh, but other than that, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.